Hello, MechTech Mike here with another installment of Convert This Techno ISO Lathe to a Centroid Acorn. Uh, here I'm showing the uh, lathe. I'm going to show you the VFD. I got it going here. Got a little part in the chuck. Coming around, I'm reusing the existing VFD from AC Tech. And there I have the Centroid Acorn installed. I, don't, I just got the motors in. I haven't had a chance to install them yet. I'm just testing out the VFD right now. You can see the Acorn software running on my little laptop here. And I'm going to go ahead and gauge it. What I do is I override the spindle. So that would mean it's controlled by the program. This is manual. So now I can engage it here. And I can fire up the speed. Currently at 18 hertz, so let's give it a little bit more speed. Okay, at yeah, 25 hertz. Okay, now I don't have the uh, encoder on it yet, so this spindle is not registering a speed at this point in time. But you can see the relay board is active, controlling the VFD. And we go around to the front here, and we've got the spindle going. All nice. Now one of the things I'm concerned about is this cable that can't be, this is the standard cable that the Techno ISO lathe came with. It's unshielded, which is concerning to me. Um, these VFDs, the way they chop up the energy, uh, can really cause some uh, EMI. And I got it hooked up to an oscilloscope right here. And uh, I have a 10X probe, so I'm looking at one, two, three, four bars at 0.2. So I'm looking at almost a volt of EMI putting the probe right there by the wires. That uh, I don't like a whole lot. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and swap out this uh, the three-phase cable for a shielded one. That should give me a little bit more immunity from EMI, especially as I run signal wires through this hole into the other side. I don't want any interference there. So I'm going to go ahead and get that done. And then in my next installment, I'll show you hooking up the Technic motors. I actually did mount them. And there they are. Nice little beauties. And uh, I'll show you how I hook them up next.